Being under embargo is this interesting feeling. I, uh, long ago a girl went missing in the pool, school pool. Everyone looked for her, but they didn't find a, even a single hair. Legend has it she's still in the pool, trying to get out. Because of her, the pool turns red at midnight. Arg. Yeah, I don't tend to like ghost stories and stuff, but this game, uh, I mean, this isn't really ghosts, but, um, like some Japanese myth stuff really makes it work. Like, um, Fatal Frame does a fantastic job. This is not what I was meant to, meaning to talk about. Um, being un under embargo is this weird feeling where, what the hell? Red crayon note found. What is that? read that now. Um, where I, after I ended the last video I wanted to go up on Twitter and say something but the embargo is tomorrow um, which is or well tomorrow from when I'm recording this um, it'll be obviously I'll have released my first video before then um, but anyway it, it's just a weird feeling to not be able to talk about stuff but uh, I totally understand why and I don't have major complaints uh, the embargo for this game is way before release anyway. I only mind embargoes when the worst case is like after release, like that is screwed up. Uh, day of release, I don't mind for indie stuff. I find it's a problem for like AAA stuff because like, you know, the reason you have an embargo is so you know you can focus your marketing efforts. And so on indie games, you know they don't really have the ability to sustain marketing efforts, so they just want all that to happen on the day of release because you know people can buy it. Uh, but AAA, you know, they usually have you know. A lot of marketing money in place and they can you know drive that push f for marketing for you know a week or so at, at the, you know the very least and then there's stuff like final fantasy 15 that's had like a 10-year marketing push i swear that must have that has to be like one of the most advertised games in the history of mankind now they have like there's at least three different marketing games for it anyway back to this game red crayon note mom won't come back home where'd she go out at this hour that's what the note says I really like games where they have like these monsters that like, like the spook. They're, they're not trying to kill you. They're like it's like the prisoner in Silent Hill 2. I'm gonna mention Silent Hill a lot in this series. I can already tell, but yeah, it's like that pr prisoner in, Mo in Silent Hill 2. It was like really screwed up. There's this, there's this invisible prisoner that you can hear them. You can hear the sounds it makes. You can hear the static it creates. You can shoot it, but you can't see it, and it never attacks you, and it's really unnerving. And it doesn't have to try to kill you to, you know, be scary. And and it, it lets you be curious without, you know, stuff just killing you. And sometimes that's really important to horror. I really don't like the... the, the come on. Up ahead, chicken coop, left dumpster. Right pool. I'm not sure the dumpster really necessitates. What? What's this? It's Sis's shoe. Why is it here? Oh, fuck. What the hell? The tail looks like Poro. That head is... Oh. Go away. That wasn't Poro. Ah! Hmm. Oops, Mr. Mouse, go away. I forgot about Sis's shoe. I have to go get it. The dumpster is up ahead. You can find a lot of stuff in the dump! It's dangerous, so I wouldn't go in there. Is up ahead. Oh dang. This is one creepy ass dumpster building. Like, who has a dumpster building for one thing? I don't like the sound of that. Oh, I guess it's clear. This is the worst, most terrifying school ever. Is this is shoe. Oh. Hey!
Get back here. Freaking jerk. Nobody steals my sister's shoes but me. And they're too big for me anyway. I usually just throw them up on the clothesline. What's this? There's the- oh. There's chickens! Normal non-murder chickens. Non-murder chickens are my favorite kind of chickens. Open the door. Looks like it's locked. Oh, right. It's a toy, but it has nicked edges. Is that really a key? Or is it just like a key item, maybe? Let's see, yeah, we need the key to get in there. There's obviously something important in there. Maybe I can distract it with something. Uh. uh not that. What is a desk doing out here? Looks like you can put something here. Oh. Not put a bone on there. Oh, fuck! I didn't like what I put there. What should I put there? Huh. Apparently, my bones and the fit animal treats aren't gonna work. I haven't seen a dog lately. Clacker found. Uh, what am I doing? Oops. Um, scrapbook. Clacker. If I keep on hitting it, it makes me kind of happy. Oh yeah, it's one of those, like, I guess you'd call it a toy? Just kind of noise make thing. What is that? What is that? There's a thing in there. Oh, dang it, there's so much stuff in there. I guess we gotta find something for Mr. Dog Jerk. Uh, that wasn't Poro indeed. Hmm. Well, we have been told there's lots of bountiful things in the dumpster, so sure, let's go there. I really love the art style of this game. It, it, it really sells the like, You know, that feeling of being a kid and you're scared and there's really weird stuff going on. Have I gone this way? I don't think so. I do get nervous behind the trees though, because then- OH FUCK! there. I hate that dog so much. Oh god damn it, there's that guy again. Ugh, I'm headed outward. Like, this is the way out. Damn it, I need to go back. Let's, uh, let's just... And that's the way out. Hmm. I didn't expect to see that stupid dog thing, like, out in the open like that. So I need to go to the dumpster, I think. Or rather, the dumpster seems to be the only way I can go. I can't go not allowed up those steps. Interesting to the backpacks. I thought maybe I could get something from the backpack, but no, they're just they're just there for spoops. What's Oh, I think it's just that. It's kind of annoying that the hiding places activate that question mark, because Keep expecting it to be like an item that I can pick up. Head. Wait. Chicken coop left dumpster. So I guess dumpster. 
Okay, I was just making sounds with the stuff I was running on. I, I, it always weirds me out, like... In horror games, you can kind of get scared of your own footsteps. If they suddenly get louder or something. That heartbeat system is very... Good at getting a rise out of you. Oh fuck! Oh Jesus. Okay. No. Is that one crying blood? Oh god damn it, why are there so many? Do they move in a fixed pattern? I don't think they can see. Oh fuck! Oh! Damn it. I think they move in a fixed pattern, but they're still very dangerous. <gasps> what the fuck? I hate that fucking dog. I take back what I said about not wanting to see dogs get hurt. Oh, come on! Fuck off! Uh, I guess I have to take the long way now. I need to see this dope ghost dog get murdered. He deserves to die, not frickin' Poro. Oh god damn it, I just fucking... There's too many of that dog. At least it's kinda easy to get around things. I The one thing I really didn't like in Amnesia, and to a greatly lesser extent in Soma, uh, is a couple areas that you just get stuck on and you die like several times, at least I did. And that really destroys any sense of fear when you like know you're gonna die. It's just like, oh, not this again. And you don't feel scared. You just feel, oh god damn it. Um, you do feel, oh god damn it. You just feel this annoyance. Like it's not scary. It's just frustrating. Um, but in this game, it seems pretty easy to avoid stuff. You just, it, it has the tension, but it doesn't have the like, ah, oh, yep. A thing saw me. I'm dead. It's actually a lot scarier when it stuff's like when you're just barely sneaking past stuff. That that is the true horror. That's that is good stuff. Um, like Silent Hill, you could always get around stuff. That's one thing. I, I, the no weapons kind of horror, like Amnesia, Outlast, and stuff. Since everything is an instant kill, I find it a lot less scary actually. Um, though this game does have the instant kills, but. It, you get more chance to evade stuff in this. It seems- oh god, they can't see. Why do they react? Sound? No? I think they just charge at your ass. I don't- I don't even know. Oh god, their eyes are holes. Oh fuck. It's a child spirit. Chicken coop he found. Oh, fuck! I thought it was safe. I thought it was just- wait, do I keep the key? I have the chicken coop key. Alright, I, I actually- that's- I really like that you don't have to like repeat stuff. Is that- oh fuck! I hate that dog! If I hide in the thing? Whew. I hate that dog. I need to go around. Oh, that's a backpack. Okay. I, I thought that the kid ghost thing was like a passive thing that wouldn't hurt you. Because the other one was, but it was like trapped. I, I, I think that can, I guess it can kill you. But, uh, hopefully there's something in the chicken coop that... Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, you can adjust the angle with the right stick. That is very good to know. Okay. See, I, it's been a little hard to scope stuff out. Oh, 
don't think it's following me. All right. All right, we're in the clear. All right, looks like it's locked. But I got the chicken coop key. Oh, fuck. Pool key found. That... That... Is that... That chicken's flipping out. Oh, it just snapshot after you. Okay. All right. So we need to check out the pool, I guess. Let's see if there's any of that stupid jerk dog wants. Fuck off! Fuck off! Okay. Fucker. All right. All right. Oh, motherfucker! Fuck off! Uh, forgot that that road is the impossible road that you can't freaking check out because of that jackass. Wait, can you get around here? No. This does. This game does have kind of the you know, knee-high wall problem. Where, like, we can't climb over these tree things, but... Eh. Then again, she's a little kid, so a lot of stuff that wouldn't be a big uh, big deal for, like, a full-grown adult might be a bit more serious for her. So where's... Which way was the pool? Door? I forget if it was at the top or the bottom. Oh, fuck. I better be at the top. So I think I can get around that one. I like that some of the enemies, like, you know you can get around if you do certain things like that. The thing I ran past, I'm pretty sure it watches your light. Yeah, I think the door was up here, right? Yeah. All right. Door to the key to the pool. The lock opened. There's notches on that door. Th oh, fuck. Um, on the shovel. So I assume at some point it will in fact be used as a key. What's this? Oh fuck. Son of a bitch. Oh god. That is a big fuck. Oh that whispering. That is good. Ah oh, fuck. Do I get in the pool this way? Yep. That's pretty fucked up. What's this? It's a drain pipe! Drain the pool and check the bottom. Hell yes! Kill that awful fish thing. Is this really how pools work? Like, this is just a valve you turn and boom, it's dry? Okay, that thing... That thing doesn't need water to swim. I was really hoping we would kill that thing. Apparently not. On the plus side, we can see it without the flashlight, so I can turn off the flashlight just in case that it's a drain. I guess that's how the drain pipe works. Oh fuck. Is it... Torn swimsuit found. Uh, girl's swimsuit that I found in the pool. It's torn up. Rest in peace. What the oh, it's just the drain pipes, so assume the fishies are horrible death. Um still looking for Ah. Puzzle piece one found. It's still not gonna help me get past the dog. There's gotta be a key item in here, right? I I need a system to search the pool better. That can't have been all there was. That's a drain. It's a drain. Ah, there's something stuck in here. Grab it. Yes. Wet bone found. Small bone that was stuck in a drain. Soft mold is growing on it. That's probably that girl they were talking about. Oh, fuck. That thing can follow me into the pool? I think we've found everything in the pool. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Oh, god damn it! Okay. Let's... 
Uh, I guess we gotta take the long way. That makes sense. So horror games always work. Did they take the long, spooky route? Because the direct route is always instant death or locked one way. Oh fuck. 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 Okay, go, 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 go. Okay. Oh fuck. And yeah, she runs like she runs out of stamina way faster when she's scared. Which, you know, I probably would. Well, adrenaline. Whatever. Game mechanics. Alright, so we have the wet bone. Let's let's feed this stupid asshole dog that I want to see his skull caved in. <sighs> oh, fuck off, backpack. Yeah, that weird goopy sound is the backpack, in fact. All right, one last time, we're gonna get Sis's shoe, and hopefully, oh fuck. Hopefully use it to cave in that dog's skull or something. All right, all right, we're fine, we're fine. That's a nice tense, like, choke point there. Hopefully not literally choke, but, erg. All right. I have a gross bone, you stupid mutt. I took the wet bone. Fucker! Get out of here. I hate that dog. It's gone. What's this? Oh. See, there's some stuff in here. Recorder found. Oh, it's just like we had recorders in my school, too. It's a little bad flute. I can't play it well, but Sis is really good at playing at it. Oh. It's Sis's, isn't it? Slippers found. It's not her shoe either. Oh, is it? No? Where's the slippers? Cloth shoes that I wear in school. It's slippery on rainy days, so I fall down a lot. I like how they add some story through the items you collect, like the... Oh, there's a shoe. Better get it before whatever it is heart beating. It's this is shoe. I guess we're gonna go home. Yep. It has been completed. Evening. I'm pretty sure it's like a little bit later than evening, but whatever. I guess that's where we'll cut it. This is shoe. I remember putting this on. She wore this on the day she left. The day? It's been days. She only wearing one shoe right now. I have no clue where sis went, but I have to find her. Should start at the rice fields. Okay. Why did I take the skull out? What the hell? Why did she keep the skull? I guess you collect the items and bring them home? But why the skull, dude? Oh well. Um. I wish this had different safes. Like, I think... How do I... Oh. That closes the game entirely. I'm not sure how the save slots work yet. I've only I've only played them with one slot. Also, this game does not like being recorded much. There we go. Um, it took a little bit of fussing to get it to record right, but uh, it's working now. I mean, I've I found games that are harder to record. Um, Oh, I guess it only has one save file on PC, even? Huh. I guess as long as it's not like branching paths and stuff, it might not be a huge deal. But, hey, what's this thing? Where are my parents? Is it just me and Sis? Hmm. I don't know. But yeah, we'll, we'll be back. And I guess we'll search, where are the rice fields? Oh, it's up. There, I guess, hill, pond, cliff. Can I zoom out? Movement? No, can't zoom. Try it down, down. Looks like a big old map. There's something bad over there. I guess we're going to the fields. 
So yeah, tomorrow we'll, or next time, we'll look for cysts in the fields.